Okay guys, good morning from Manila. I'm actually in Quezon City and I'm waiting for an ANCAS which is similar to Grab for motorbikes here in Manila to go to Makati. I have to go to meet Lai and also I'm still looking for a place to kind of base myself here in Manila checking out new areas. So I've been in Quezon for a little bit. I'm gonna go to Makati now, like walk around the area, eat something there, check out the area around there. And still trying to figure out where I'm gonna stay. So still looking for some suggestions from you guys. So just gotta wait for this driver to come. And it's gonna cost 262 pesos for this drive. Okay guys, I'm on the Ancas now, heading to Makati. Uh, one of the only reasons I actually don't like about staying in Quezon is it's pretty busy out here and when you do want to go to like Makati which is where all the nightlife is pretty much uh, there's no public transport also to get there so you always have to take like a motorbike and a car so it's only about like I'd say 15 kilometers the distance but those who have been to Manila will know the traffic's just ridiculous and when there's no trains or anything running through it's kind of not convenient. You know what, I thought it was like meant to be summer as well in Manila and to be honest it's been raining a bit, a good bit. So I'm with the ANCAS driver now and we're all stuck underneath this bridge. This is what I'm talking about guys, when there's no like trains and public transport everywhere it's a nightmare if it starts to rain. This journey normally takes on the motorbike like maybe 40 minutes, god knows how long it's going to take there. Okay, well off again, in and out the rain, dodging the rain today. I'm pretty sure this uh, is the LRT line right there, this thing. Well they only have like two lines and it doesn't really go like everywhere in the city. So I finally found a lie and we're in Poblacion, where the naughty night life is, <laughs> isn't it? But uh, it's really not all that busy, only on the weekend and I can see the lights. I'm gonna finally go inside the popular filling station to eat. It's kind of a themed diner, I suppose, like American style. So that's where we will eat dinner. It stopped raining, which is good. This is it, pretty quiet. But this is the place you will find all the foreigners. A lot. A lot. All the Joes. All the Joes. Filling station, <laughs> massage and everything, huh? <laughs> Look at that guy. Do, do you have a picture there too, inside? I think like all Filipinos have been here. Let's go, 24 hours, that's why. Let's have a look there. Just want to have a look. Check it out, this is what it's like in the downstairs. They have all the old cars, old shell pumps. Very themed. So let's go up and check out the restaurant. It's kind of cool, to people come here to take photos a lot and stuff. Let's go up to the restaurant. It's got all the old posters up. Elvis, the Godfather. Hello. What's in there? The stack. What's this? It's got like two floors. Which one do we eat on? This one. Ah, this is it. Check it out. Oh, look. Oh, it's very American style, isn't it? Me and Lai is just gonna have a dinner here tonight. Like, I was kind of stuck in the traffic today, in the rain. Were you? She was, no, she was on the trains and motorbikes to avoid the traffic, so. Yeah, long day. Beers have arrived in time. Yeah, the weather was really good today. You want ice? Oh, 
like to bring beer with ice since I've lived in Asia. <laughs> We actually do not drink that much. So far, I don't really drink a lot. What? <laughs> we don't really drink, right? It's just like for the first time again. Yeah. It just seems to be every video. The last time we just had salt, it was like a few days ago. And then now we're just like healing back because the traffic must be really bad outside. So. We have to kill the time with beer. Yeah, exactly. Lies idea, not mine. <laughs> I know my mom's watching, so no. it's just something like. <laughs> well, it's a bit loud in this uh, filling station, guys, but we got the sharing platter. It's got some fish, quesadilla, chips, chicken, some sauces in the middle, two San Miguel's. I'll tell you the total on the screen now. It looks alright, it looks not too bad for the money. Really American. Yeah, true, really American. Um, what I was gonna say, yeah, so basically we just got a sharing platter as a snack and two beers because we have to wait for the rush hour traffic to go. We'll probably end up in McDonald's at 2 a.m. for ice cream. This is the case here that you like that one, isn't it? What's this sauce? Well, the sauce is good. Chicken? This one? What's that one? Great. But this one's like mozzarella. The little chunks of, I'm guessing it's cod fish. Got some tartar sauce there too. I thought it was garlic mayo, but it's tartar sauce. Really nice, fresh fish. I didn't film much after filling station because it was a bit a little bit noisy in there and it's noisy right now on the road too but the food there was all right I wouldn't say it was great I wouldn't say it was bad it's a bit more pricey than what you will get in another place in the Philippines because it's in the main tourist area oh my god now we're back in uh, Quezon City it's already night we've been stuck in traffic obviously and we're going for what? going for um, I don't know, another dinner <laughs> 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 I was hoping you were going to say the name, but Lai's pointing out we've had two dinners tonight. <laughs> so this is going to be our second dinner. Second dinner. Uh, I don't know, it's like um, the Lo rice porridge. What's it called though? Lo Lugao. Lugao. Goto. Goto. Oui, sleepy. So yeah, we're going to go for a local Filipino dinner. But what do you think? Filling stations are right? Or? For me? Okay, but I don't really prepare. Yeah. I mean, like, <laughs> that, that was a bad review. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's okay. It's kind of like, it's okay. It's like um, common American food, you know? Yeah. We've come to another local restaurant called Gans. <laughs> I cannot say the second name, for La Luja. Yeah, this is what it looks like self service. What are we going to order? Lugao. Lugao. Yeah, this, this is this is where the so the Lugao. Hello. So this is the restaurant set, set up. Got a burger joint over there. Angels Burger sell so hot dogs and burgers, and this is the little restaurant we're gonna eat our second meal in. What is it, babe? Huh? How many, how many meals you make in here? Light looks to make me eat. I think she's trying to put a bit of weight on me. Not that I need it. Thanks. It's always a bit loud. Hello. Yeah. We got the guys in Angel's Pizza. Do you, do you want to give a food review? Yeah. 
It's nice. It's nice. Okay, salamat po. I'll grab that. Yeah. Soup, yeah? It's just free anyway. So. And what she says? Um, it's so late because we buy the road, but this is 35 pesos. It's like a rice porridge, got some pepper in there. Got some, is that chili? What's, what's yeah, that? Chili, pepper. Yeah, chili, pepper, um, a bit of everything. What's that? Egg. Uh -huh. <laughs> Good night. <laughs> Why did I ask you what that is? I oh, know what an egg is. I thought you were going to say something like balot. She said, egg. <laughs> and then I feel stupid. <laughs> then you realise that. I was like, well, yeah. I know it's an egg lie. <laughs> Let's give it a try, this log and mix it all in. It is actually very porridge, yeah? Mm. It's nice. It's good if you feel like it's sick. sick. Let's give it a try. Mm. I actually like this. This is really nice, peppery, salty a little bit. Got the rice, a lot of good taste. Mm. Tofu. <laughs> and we've got some tofu in vinegar. I, I don't think I ever actually ate this before in Philippines, do I? Really? I don't think so. Nice, Unless it's called something else in a different dialect. No? And they always give you a, ah, shit, a hot cup of soup. Let's give this tofu tofu in vinegar a dry Good. actually this is better than filling station only 35 pesos mm. go on Lai she knows I'm not fussy with the food so she can just throw anything in my food I'm the real Filipino if me and Lai were to travel to another country, which country would you want it to be? Comment down below. <laughs> Lai said, whichever's got the most comments, I have to take a... Late night cravings. Okay, so this is another thing we like to do. We like to eat dinner, and then normally at like 1am, 2am, 3am, we take a little trip somewhere. I need to eat McDonald's or this. But you have to sleep McDonald's for tonight. Yeah, we've been good. It's pretty hot outside actually to be eating a hot rice porridge, but and a hot soup too. But everyone always asks me, do I ever get sick when I like eat all these street foods? And the answer is no. Actually, like was shocked, right? You were shocked about that. She said, "Yeah, like, guys, like because I just travel so much. I think I've got a strong stomach, so like, I can literally eat anywhere. And even sometimes I choose places, and lies like, really, you can eat here, right? So I'm pretty easy to eat anywhere. Did you ever eat Angel's Burger? Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> What? <laughs> you have to try that as well. It's, for me, it's like the best burger. The best burger? In the Philippines. Do you know, I've passed it so many times, I've never tried it. It's famous here because it's kind of like buy one, pick one burger, you know? Is it? Okay, will you try after? <laughs> <laughs> Third dinner. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, it's best with like, you know. But it's only 50 pesos. Mm. But it's just burger. Not bad. 50 peso burger from Angels. Um, I will try it either later or in another video. Maybe in another one. I'm pretty full. Mm. Me too. It's kind of like the typical Filipino merienda, you know? What is? I mean, Filipino snack. This? Mm. Burger? Merienda is like snack during like late afternoon you know, people. I'm still like trying to get used to this. Mm. Like having... Um, late afternoon snack like even just bread yeah 
I was shocked that when you told me that. I'm, I'm having a snack. What? Yes. You say pizza. I was like, what? Pizza is not a snack. <laughs> but anyway. Yeah. So they also eat burgers for snacks in the Philippines. So that was our late night lugao snack. Very nice. First time I ate it. It's just kind of like a rice porridge. So I've ate similar things obviously in different countries. Good choice lime. At least it was a healthy choice today. Yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. See you on the next one. Ciao. <laughs> you copy me, you know I say ciao. Yes, I know you're going to say that at the end of the video. Oh. Ciao. Okay, joke, yeah. <laughs> <laughs>